Fed B was our last win, and it was a, if I remember correctly, a pretty crazy comeback that I thought we were going to lose, so it's always nice to get a comeback victory. But, uh, I'm, I'm barely waking up, so hopefully I'll wake up quickly enough to not die quickly to some, some crazy, I don't know, missile to the weapons or something, so... We have, uh, on this streak, we have one with the Fed A, the Fed B, and the Kestrel C. So let's random our first ship of the day, see what it is, and see if we're going to die. So here we go. Random ship in three, two, one, and random. The Rock A. Oh my gosh, it's my favorite Rock A. <laughs> oh god. Uh, let's see. The Rock A. So this ship used to be my least favorite. Uh, I still dislike it immensely because I hate running out of missiles. I don't know that it's my least favorite in hard mode no pause now because things like Fed C are terrible and NGA and Slug B. But oh, this is a tough one. Having all of your offense be... You basically have a timer on... Uh, missiles might be a timer on your health, but your missiles are a timer on your offense on this ship. So... It's really easy to run out of missiles on this on this ship. So the number one goal, probably even before getting second shields in sector one, is try to get a non-missile using weapon in sector one. Or teleporter. I guess that's the other option. This is the gorilla ship. Uh, I don't know if I understand that reference. Uh, let's see, is there anything I need to do here? Move guys around, it's three rock crew. No, nothing special. We just need to be as efficient with our missiles as possible. Find a first door. If we can't get a weapon, maybe get teleporter. Don't forget about the absolutely fun layout of this rock ship. Um, I don't think I hate this layout. It's actually pretty good for venting. I don't know what you mean about the fun layout, though. All right, uh, do I want to jump right into the nebula? Would I take a chance for... Uh, hmm. Hold on a second. Three jumps does get me two extra jumps. I think I do want to go into all three nebula jumps. The O2 opposite where crew is and slow crew. I mean, I I don't think I've ever felt super punished by the layout of this ship, to be honest. I don't think so, anyway. Damn, I was hoping he'd fire that one shot. Okay, that's a great dodge. We're gonna go for this. That hits, it was just guaranteed. And one more missile. All right, good dodges to start the run. Three missiles it took, but good dodges. Uh, one thing I also need to remember is, I think a recommendation is to take missile deals when they're offered. Missile deals can actually be quite helpful. Rocks are like gorillas, big compared to the humans. Okay. <laughs> I thought you meant the band gorillas who's saying, I'm happy. I'm feeling sad. I got sunshine in a bag. I'm useless. I thought you were talking about those gorillas, but I guess you're not talking about those gorillas. All right, no empty. Ugh. This is going to take at least four missiles to kill this guy. Okay, at least his weapons aren't amazing. Uh, explosive replicator and then an only missile run. I mean, that is definitely an option. Okay, he didn't hit my shields at least. We do this, we are immune to damage. We've got a breach, so... Okay, that's all the damage we're taking, that one. Go make sure I didn't get a fire in here from that beam. You're thinking... You were thinking of those gorillas, that's why you wrote with a Z. Okay. Well, I don't know how this ship is like that, but cool. <laughs> May I please have some missiles? I got a single missile after using four to kill that guy. Okay. Um. Uh, all right, and I don't, I don't know why you keep all your jokes are about belittling the French people, but okay, great. I'm not gonna read it out loud. All right, let's see here. Uh, he's running, so he dies from two, two, two shots. So Monday went well then. Uh, I didn't play hard no pause on Mondays. We play viewerships on Mondays. Yeah, that's not too bad. How's the run so far? We're like three jumps in, Crow, so we're not dead. <laughs> we're using a lot of missiles, though. We're using a lot of missiles. 
All the best jokes belittle the French. Uh, okay, sure. Um, you were moving on Monday and started a new job the day after. Oh, wow. Well, I'm moving on a week from yesterday. So, moving buddies. Heck, I hope your move went well. Uh, Friday then? Um... Well, last Wednesday did not go well. I think we won, then lost, and won, then lost. Or lost, then won, then lost, and won. Something like that. So we only have a streak of three currently. The more you look at the layout of the ship, the more strange it seems. I don't I don't understand what y'all are talking about the layout being weird. I honestly think it's a pretty good layout because you can... Almost every room is like two or three rooms, uh, spaces from a vent, so it's pretty easily ventable. The important rooms are center, not at the edges. The heel bay is... I, I honestly think the layout is on this ship is better than a lot of other ships in the game, so I just don't understand about... I'm talking about a weird layout. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, we should be able to get these nine easily. So our goal is just to find a store, sell rock coal plating, get a non-missile using weapon. That is our goal. Uh, your j jokes about the French are the best, and this one's not that rude. I mean, it's making fun of them losing. <laughs> so I, I guess it's not that bad. I don't know. Uh, or what was it? It was a joke about it's the first time they've ever won anything without help. I mean, okay. Uh, look for the rebel ship. Okay, well, at least I didn't lose a jump there. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right. Uh, I'm going to get... I'm going to go one, two, three, four, five. Maybe one, two, three... Because I can get a second store. Just the position of the doors themselves suck. Okay. A little bit. It does make venting the O2 tough, but... Honestly, there are way worse layouts in this ship. So I don't mind this layout a lot. Um, Alright. Pack and escape. What's up, Beta Hunter? You just finished a semester project exam today with the highest grades. You're all smiles. Nice! Congratulations on that. There's one empty room. I have, I have to deal with this guy. Can't two-shot this guy. I get it. Right. Well, I guess that's better than hitting my shield. Still, that's really annoying. There's piloting again. One more hit on an empty room will finish him. Not into my weapons, please. Okay, alright. That's that's okay. Although if he repairs and dodges, this is gonna suck. Oh god. Oh god, I have no shields. Hit. Please hit. Okay, good. Uh, I actually need you guys to heal. All right, two frickin' breaches, man. Three breaches, actually, because he boarded and breached my engines, then he breached my shields when boarding there. That was a really annoying fight. At least he didn't have a missile. A missile would have been an even worse annoyance. Yeah, you go for it. So that breach. Uh, Bader Hunter, were you the one who gave me the... Who gave me the link to the uh, video of... The video game thing and... Where was it? In Maryland or something. I watched a bunch of that. That was really good. That was you? Oh, that was you, Bilbo. That was really cool, actually. I was expecting it to be another one of those things like, eh, I'm not that interested. But, man, those were some amazing musicians. Uh, what was it called? The v VGA or... What was that? What was that concert or... Um... Festival called. Um, where it was basically eight big band at MAGFest. That's what I, I wanted to say MAGFest, but I wanted to make sure it wasn't MAGA, M-A-G-A. I wanted to make sure it wasn't that. The MAGFest. That was really freaking cool, man. Some amazing musicians. The 8-bit band, 8-bit big band is apparently amazing. 
What's funny is one of the the uh, bass player they featured is a YouTuber that I actually subscribed to. I was like, oh my gosh, I know this guy. So a bunch of those musicians must be like well-known YouTube musicians and stuff. All right, no weapons. Damn. And no teleporter. If I sell this, I have 90 scrap. I can get hacking if I do this. I have three drone parts. How many more chances do I have at stores? One, two, three, four. Four more chances at another store. It's only one of the performances, too. They have a bunch there as well as a gaming hall and stuff. Super fun event. That looks really awesome, yeah. I think I have enough missiles that I'm going to be greedy and not get hacking here. I feel like getting hacking when I haven't swapped out my weapons and I only have three drone parts. It's probably the right choice, but I, I need an offensive upgrade that doesn't make me run out of consumables. God, should I just get hacking? Yeah, I kind of agree that hacking... I mean, it does help because it means I can't dodge. But I'm still running out of stuff. I think I'm going to not buy hacking. Maybe that's the wrong play and that's the mistake I make this run. I can two-shot this guy. Oh, oh, shield hack. Okay, well, thank God for... If not having a heavy laser, man. Don't hit my weapons. Don't hit my weapons. It's fine. Don't hit my weapons. Don't hit my weapons. We two shot him at least. Okay. Alright, that could have been worse. Only two one damage missiles I think we got here with there. What's up, Ankle Bane? Yeah, I kinda I was really impressed by the guy who leads that 8 bit big band. He like he sang, he was conducting, he apparently wrote all or most of their arrangements. Played multiple instruments. It's like, wow, that is one multi-talented guy right there. Get second shield. If I do that, and then there's a store. I'd be able to sell. I think I'd still be able to sell something, so I am going to do that. Hope my store is, if it is here or here, that I get. If there's another store over here, I'm not going to be able to get it without diving. When you played Rock A the other day, you got a shield hack beam master on the first jump. Ugh. This sucks. This guy's running. Okay. Do this, I think. Okay. God damn it. Of course he dodges my first shot. Why the hell wouldn't he? Stop hitting my weapons, game. Stop it. Okay, we actually dodged. Something is good. I guess I'll hit the empty room. Oh, I'll attempt to hit the empty room. Okay, didn't dodge. Oh, I have to hit this again for him not to get out. It's taking so many missiles. Okay, alright. Oh, we took a lot of damage and we used a lot of missiles. We got two missiles back. Ugh. God, this ship sucks. This ship sucks, man. Actually, what really sucks is just the enemy having missiles. That's just the thing that sucks. They just have missiles. I get effed. We have a decent amount of scrap if we can find a store to get a, you know, a weapon. My last chance of store that we can get without diving is here or the exit beacon. Solar flare. God damn it. A pirate disruptor, missile hacking, heavy laser. I didn't get, don't have my O2. Okay, that's a decent hack for us. I gotta get this missile offline. No dodges for me, man, I swear.
Okay. I need to fix my shields before I leave if possible. Or take another solar flare too as well, I hope. Okay, they got that fixed. That's good. I'm not gonna fix my my heal bay in time before solar flare, so I'm just gonna get in position here. No store, damn. Low health, ten missiles. Every ship has a goddamn missile. Oh, I hate you, game. I hate you. I can't two-shot you. None of these guys are even low enough health that I can two-shot them either. F my life, man. Okay, good. Alright, well, we're down to six missiles. No, I'm not taking a human. I, I need... I need scrap, not stupid human group. If that was an NG, I would have taken it. Six frickin' missiles left, man. This is why this ship sucks. This right here. I've been trying to be efficient, but like every ship's got missiles, so I have to get his missiles offline so I can't focus piloting that empty room for hold missile value. We're just we're just about to be unable to kill anybody, so we we need a store beginning of next sector. Right. Create scrap is something, I guess. NG, yes, for the love of God, give me stores without missile weapons for sale. That is a dead end over there. Okay. I'm gonna go here to see if either of those jumps are stores. If they're not, then we're going this way. And I have six missiles left, so if we have a bunch of ship fights... And NGs are likely to have defense drones... Ugh. Um, man, if we got a map, that would be really nice. If we get a ship fight, it takes at least three missiles to kill this guy. I was just really... I think if we kill him, we get a map, too. That's the other reason I went for this. Please don't dodge. Please don't dodge. Thank you. Okay. It did took the minimum... It did take the minimum amount of missiles, thankfully. Alright, do we get a map? We didn't even get a map. Ah, Lee, man. I thought you could get a map from that. When you kill him, because it's a scout ship or something. I think we've got two missiles back, though, so at least that's good. So this is a dead end, so I can't go that way. A bad sector layout, man. I need one of these. I need. I need a store. I just need a store now. This ship made you rage quit so hard yesterday. All right, free stuff is good. NG free stuff is great, and I didn't have to use any missiles for that fight. Empty jump is empty. I'm actually kind of okay with empty jumps right now. Oh god. Oh god, free intruders. Oh god, please don't have a... Oh, he's got hacking and drone control? Got a defense drone. I can't kill this guy. I don't think it's possible for me to kill this guy. F U F T L. Um, I do need to get that weapon offline, though, at least. I use two missiles just to try to take no damage. No more damage. Can't even run, man. Two missiles per shot. Yeah, I literally cannot kill this guy. Can't hack my piloting and slow us down, leaving. Well, at least didn't hack my shields. Maybe my shield, a shield hack would be even worse. I don't know, I'm just gonna leave. I can't waste my missiles here. I would take a teleporter right now. I just need some form of offense that does not require missiles. 
Uh, he's got Mantis repairing over there, at least, so... That's good. Love of God, Store. Thank you. Thank you, Store. Right, please have weapons. Alright, looks like we're gonna have to go teleporter, my friends. Looks like we're gonna have to go teleporter. Is there another store? Not that I see. Uh, either teleporter or buy missiles, or maybe even both, honestly. Teleporter costs 90. Hence, two drone. God, I think I have to do this. Yeah, I know, Artemis plus boarding is pretty good. It's not what I want to do, but I, I think it's the play. I think that's the play. I'm thinking about buying an NG, too. An NG, a power, and repairs. NG for blue options. I'm not going to sell miss. Well, not both my missiles yet. I might sell my whole missile, though. Maybe one of the rock borders, sure. I need fuel. I think I even need to buy a couple missiles. And I need power. Well, maybe I don't need power if I'm doing that. Yeah, actually, I don't need power. Um... I'm even buy missiles here. I don't love this, but I think this is the right play. We're now a boarding ship. Um, here you go, Martian Prince. Watch me fight all auto scouts now. The drone says we're coming with combat drone. Yes, but I have seven drone parts. I don't think swapping to drone offense is going to be better than what we currently have. I think it would be actually way worse. So, six at four... One, one, two, three, four. Hmm. How do I do this? Okay, that connects to that. So I can go one, two, three, four, five, six. I can do it. Okay. Those all connect. All right. And if we have an NG blue option to stress beacon, that NG immediately pays for itself. Oh, it's just a ship fight. Okay. Um, he can't damage us, so let's see what I'm what I'm boarding into before I board. Three humans. Okay. Do I need to not use missiles if I can help it? Uh, do I need to do a second group of boarding to win the fight? Probably. I'm gonna send the NG. NG boarding party, go! Go. NG tank for me, bro. Let them get the fighting training. Okay. Give them nothing. NGs feel no fear. Alright, we're a boarding ship, man. We're a boarding ship. Yeah, I know. First ship that couldn't damage us this game, I think. It's a war NG, you know it. Yeah, drone offense wouldn't last very long with only seven drone parts. Um, well, to me, it's just a single combat drone. What is that going to do? Income combination with missiles, maybe, but I had three missiles left. I mean... Going further into offense that has consum that uses consumables just does not feel good to me, so. Oh, okay, there's a store. Watch this store have all the weapons I want. Man, do I go to store with 47 scrap? I could buy long range scanners. Sell Artemis for a flak or a burst. I couldn't sell it for burst laser 2. Could buy a single ion. Austin getting a snow. How should I know? I live in Dallas. <laughs> uh, Dallas isn't, but I don't know about Austin. 
Um, I'm thinking about skipping this door. I need I need scrap gains, and I just I can't think of anything at the store that I get that will be worth it right now that I could afford. This missile sells for what like nineteen, which would give me what fifty seven plus nine, sixty six. That would be just enough for a flak, I think. But I know that a flak plus boarding would actually be better than this missile plus boarding. I'm gonna skip it. I'm gonna skip this door. I'm so glad I skipped that door. Holy fire beam boarding build, Batman. Okay. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna use that, but that is quite interesting. I would need to get shields down before I can even use that, so I don't think I'm going to use that. Okay, this guy's running. He's got internal drones. Oh god, I can't. Uh, I have to use my art. Oh, Jesus Christ. I need to do this. I need that to hit. I need to get you over here. That pulls the pilot. Okay, okay. Now we... Okay. This thing blocks teleporters. So that's why I was freaking out a bit. I have to repair. I have to take that missile. So if, if he dodged my missile, my crew were stuck on his ship while his thing was charging. I... Oh, that was that was pretty scary. What's up, uh, Minariva? Crazy weather yesterday, was it? It rained. It's rainy. I don't know about crazy. It was rainy. It's not a cold, but I mean it is January. We're supposed to get at least a little bit of cold weather <laughs> in Texas. No. Uh, Sixty-nine scrap. The best amount of scrap, everybody. Um, what do I want to do? Do I save? Do I get power? Power so I can use a fire beam, potentially? Mm. Complements my boarding perfectly. Fire beam? How? How am I going to use fire beam when I literally can't do anything to their shields unless my Artemis hits and they have no value point? Or they only have one shield. Uh, okay, this is gonna steal my... This is gonna be him down. He's got a heal base, got a defense drone. Jesus. Um, how do I fight this? He can't do any damage to me. Alright. I have to I have to think about how we do this. How we do this. Because he has a heal base and a defense drone. Only two NGs. Okay. So what I have to do is I have to kill his drone control before I can take out his heal bay. So I go here. Oh god, he's got NG reinforce whatever bots. Okay. So what we have to do is we have to send... We have to get a guy in shields here. So we do this, this. Okay, I think we'll run to the heal bay. As soon as the defense drone is down, that's what we have to do. Wrong drone down. There it is. Okay, good. That should work. Now if we go all three into shields, we should 3v2 them. Okay, we got there. Alright, that was a bit of a puzzle. But we got there, we only used one missile. Thank God he didn't have Mantis on his ship. 
That's uh, that's like a, that's like a little puzzle right there. You would destroy shields and fire beam. It's double NGs. I mean, maybe. Again, it's not guaranteed. When you when they have a defense drone, how are you destroying shields? I guess with your borders. What's up, Anonymous? You finally caught an FTL stream coming over from YouTube. Welcome from the YouTubes. Glad to have you. Yeah, when you have when you have a, a, a ship that is completely immune to your weapons, and they have a heal bay, you have to finagle the AI of the crew to, to actually be able to do anything to them. All right, eh, they're just pirates. Okay, this guy can't damage us. Very nice. Let's check. He's got multiple mantis on his ship. He has no mantis on his ship. That's great. So we might just win with this. With an NG and two humans, we might not need another border. But send it. I'll send it. Honestly, do want to do some dodge training here? You know what? I'm going to... I'm going to kill this guy and I'm going to bring my guys back and heal. So we can get some potential dodge training here. Just just to work on my pilot slowly. Get a little extra dodge. New guy should have a crew. Yeah. What? If, if, yeah. If, if you would like to be one of my crew members, just let me know. People have to ask, Beta Hunter. I don't just randomly name people. They need to ask. Okay. All right, we got some fuel from it. That's good. And it's not a tradition that I just name name them crew from new people. I just whoever asks gets to be crew. All right, let's see here. Um, what's your specialty? Sensors for 17. Yeah, I'll take that deal. It's actually quite useful for boarding to see what we're jumping into as well. And that might get us some blue options. So Civilian? Oh, Mantis Homeworlds. Interesting. Interesting. Do I think I could do Kazak? All I need is level 2 heal bay. Hmm. That's a tough choice because civilian sector is good for us. Boarding into Mantis ships is a little sketchy. But Kazak would be amazing to get. You'd like to be one of the you'd like to be the Dark Rockman. Well one of them's already named, so there's only one available, and it is the one that's already Oh wait, the Dark Oh wait, you wanna be this guy? Okay, sure. You can be this guy. The pilot rockman. Uh and on emos. And then the only other rock available is Oms. I guess that's the red one. Oms. Level 2 Teleporter? I don't... Uh, maybe. You have to have level 2 Heal Bay if you want to do the Kazakh thing. Oh, man. Do I board into Mantis Land? I guess the good thing about Mantis Land is... They often have lower level shields, so if I Artemis their shields once, I could potentially Fire Beam them. Oh, and it did ask to be the pilot. Well, you know what? These are people who... Inan's always the pilot. I'm going to give another person a chance here. I'm going to do Mantis Homeworlds. Inan's always the pilot. Let's give somebody else a turn, okay? All right, let's hope we actually find Kazak here. I don't have long-range scanners to help me with it. We're fine, we're fine. At least it's only two mantis. Wanna make sure the NG does not get any training. Or the pilot. I don't want the pilot to get any training. We want our two boarders to get the training. A free combat training? Well, it cost us some health, but thankfully that's all it cost us. 
I have to be very careful with my micro, man. Very careful with my micro. Because I could easily lose crew boarding Manta ships. I want to get one power, but if I see a store, if I get a store and I miss like long range scanners, I'll regret it. I can afford long range scanners still. I guess I'll do that. Okay, two shields, a heal bay. Okay, alright. So we deal with the borders. Only single border. Um. Weapons are pretty weak, thankfully. Uh, that's bad. I don't know if I should have done that, but I'm doing that. Oh, that is a double fire, which is perfect for us. Oh, good. Oh, good. I actually didn't get punished there. Go. Beautiful. All right, that's a good fight. That is a good fight. What's up, all our guys? How are you doing? They're firebombing a rock ship. I know, right? <laughs> good play. Good plan. Nice. Right, so I'm looking for stores. The the problem with trying to find Kazakh when you don't have homeworld, uh, when you don't have long range scanners, is you're basically just guessing, because Kazakh Pleth Killik, for those who don't know, is the Mantis homeworld special quest, and it's at a ship fight. That's not a distress beacon. So I'm just guessing, and hoping we find Kazakh. Oh, and we found it. All right, he's got a clone, he's got a missile. All right, all right. He's only got two crew, though. Okay, let's kill his missile first. Good dodge. A breach that's perfect. And he might run away before he dies, which would actually be best for us. This is so good, man. This is so good. All right, now we just win this. All I gotta do is... Kill this clone boy with our missile, and that's GG. We board him, of course. Just gotta talk about Kazakh and he shows up, apparently. Nice! Quickly, teleport additional crew, check for survivors. You find Kazakh Pleth Killik slumped in a corner dying. Quickly, teleport him back to the med bay. Your haste has paid off. You were able to bring him back from the brink of death. When a sensor returning, he says, I never thought I'd see this day. I'm willing to devote myself, my ship, to your cause. Except, quest marker, Mantis Pheromones, Kazakh, good amount of scrap. And a quest marker is a free weapon, my friends. My favorite reward in the game right there. Alright, this ship has somehow become actually a pretty good boarding ship. Um... You like Mantis Pheromones to help rocks move? Yeah. Well, I'm selling it for the first good weapon I found, find, I'll be honest, but... That's depending on us actually finding a weapon. So I am looking for a store now, because we're still looking for a weapon so that I'm not just using a, an Artemis with four missiles for boarding support. So... Although we do get a free weapon from the quest. You will rename yourself as Kazakh <laughs> in real life? Okay, nice. Does have a heal bay. I think he's going to run. But if I board him... Board into... Board into here. He boards us so he's not running. That's perfect. Uh, I want to hit his weapons, but I think I'm actually going to hit... Heal Bay. Perfect. Good fight. 
Took zero damage. It's great. I will take zero damage all day or day. Or did we take... No, it was the small bomb that caused the fires. He's hoping it's not a heal bomb. The free weapon? <laughs> yeah. Actually, here's hoping it's not any missile at all. I don't think I can think of a single missile that I'd want. Maybe a small bomb would be slightly better than Artemis since it can't be shot down by defense drones, but... I don't think I care about a distress beacon that much. I need a store more than I need a distress beacon. Um, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna get one power. I can do this, so I can use that if maybe I should have gotten dodge instead. Need a poll for what weapon you think it'll be. There's so many choices. I don't know how helpful a poll would be. I've still seen zero stores. Come on, not a missile, not a missile, not a missile. <laughs> Who called it? Oh, Bilbo, why? Why did you do this to me, man? You freaking called it. You called it in the worst possible way. This is actually kind of terrifying. Three missiles left. That's why I wanted there to be the poll, so he could get the right answer, I guess, huh? We have one more jump we could get that could be a store. And if it's not a store, we go to the stress beacon, I guess. I would go one, two, three, four if that's not a store. It is the best weapon to troll me with, yes. A missile, I've got a teleporter. Actually, what I'm going to do is board in his weapons. I think that will stop him from boarding me. And I'm just going to Artemis this and could win the fight. Good. Good freaking dodge right there. And then we, well, I was going to say, we get weapon training, but it's because, ah, he's max weapons. What am I thinking? Ouch. Okay. I mean, I guess thanks for the repair training. Although, it's virus. <laughs> you know what? We have two of the special crew. I just realized. Kazak and Virus. Who else are the fully trained special crew? We just need Envoy now, right? Is Envoy the only other special full, fully trained crew? No Slug is fully trained. Uh, there's no Rock that's fully trained. Is there a human? I don't think so. No, the Rock Princess isn't fully trained. I think if we got on, boy, we'd actually have all three of the fully trained crew you can get. Come on. Uh, okay, well, you know what? We can do that quest. Quest could be a store. Man. Hmm. God, I need a store bad, but I'm diving if I do that. I can't afford a, a, a dive. I have to hope that this is a, thank you for escorting us. Now we'll show you our wares. But of course, it's a ship fight with a big giant missile instead. Of course it is. And of course, he's got a defense drone, so I can't missile him. Oh, God damn. I wish I had a small bomb right about now. Oh, thank God. That was a breach missile. We just dodged four full damage. Okay, well, we got lots of fuel. Oh, man, I need a store so bad. What about the ruined guy? Oh. I can't remember. It's been so long. I can't remember if Ruin, the special crystal guy, is fully trained or not. He, he probably is. But I honestly can't remember. Slug that begs you to pick him up? That's Slocknog, and he's not fully trained, no. He usually has, like, one training and one or two skills, I think. What's your specialty? Doors for eight. I mean, I'm getting a discount on all my subsystems when all I need is a freaking store with weapons, man. All right, thank God it's civilian. 
and not Zoltan. Ruins only fully or partially trained in two categories. Okay. I'm pretty sure there's only three crew that are fully trained in everything. Virus, Kazakh, and Envoy. I think that's right. No instant store, sadly. I got some stuff to sell. Alright, well, I got enough scrap. I need to just get myself some missile defense for right now, I guess. I am going to go to this distress beacon. I have a lot of blue option potential. Level 2 heal bay blue option. They're just pirates. Kind of like a blue option. Oh, damn it. I have five missiles, and he has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. It would take all five of my missiles to kill this guy. I don't think I kill him. I think we just run. Can I dodge, please? Nope. Well, this is terrifying. Um, can I get one of his weapons offline? Okay, thank God. Use one missile to not take more damage. Uh, how does Heal Bomb help here? You want me to board with Heal Bomb? He dodges one and we're screwed, so no, we're not doing that. Yeah. We're not doing that. So I see two jumps here. If neither of those are restored, we go down this way. Rocks last like 23 seconds if I board an auto scout. What do you think I'm gonna do? Like board the auto scout 20 times, go back and forth healing? I mean, I guess I could do that. That's so slow and so chancy that I don't think it's worth the 20 minutes it would take me to potentially kill that guy. I do not think that's worth. I know that that's not a store. I know that that is not a store. One, two, three, four, five. So I'd be able to get that one. Ah, do I go down this way or do I go across this way? Got a clone bay, a Vulcan, teleporter. Okay, I'm gonna let him board. Uh... Okay, the dodges are not good for us. Come on, come on. There it is. I'm gonna get his Vulcan offline, we're in good shape. Okay, so next we heal, choose Clone Band, then we board. Good. Reach is great. Make sure he doesn't repair that. Got Mantis on repairing there, so that's good. Uh, he's got four crew. Kazak can finish dudes off. Uh, okay, that's... Okay, actually, that kills him right there. That's some dodge training we can get here a bit. Actually, don't want to kill that, because we're getting dodge training from it. All right. All right, well, that's a double reward. I was hoping for, like, a store or something. I'm just so desperate for a store right now, man. Dodge training for virus. Well, it's more for the pirate. Pirate. Pilot. And I cannot talk today. It's for the pilot to get some dodge training. And he is getting close to being max trained now, so that's good. 
Where are my stores, man? Where are my stores? Uh, 242 scrap. I, I guess I'll get level 2 teleporter right now. So I can board faster. Like, all I need is a weapon that's not a missile. I cannot give away two missiles right now. I just, I can't do that. Normally I'd jump on a deal like that. What's up, Real Rock B? Come on, civilian sector. Give me a fucking break, man. Missile auto scouts. With my boarding ship. There's literally nothing I can do here. Oh, God damn, he just hacked my dodge. I, I, I just, I try to get his missile offline while we run away. I think that's the play. And he dodges it, because why the hell wouldn't he dodge it? I'm using one more. I hate this game. Man, I think my run is actually dead here. This is an auto hacker that hacked my engines with a two damage missile. What is the counterplay to bullshit like this? Get the hell out is the counterplay, but he keeps hacking me. Fuck you, game. God damn it. We were just about to get out, too. Christ almighty. I hate this game. Get me the hell out. Is there a store? Thank God there's a store. What a bullshit ship that was, man. Are there weapons? Finally, there's weapons. I don't think they're any good, but there at least are weapons. Heal in the meantime. There's some time for the salt. I'm trying to, I'm trying to keep less tilting style of stealth today. That is still rage inducing. An auto hacker with a missile and hacking is just effing stupid. I'm trying to not get go full tilt here. Okay. <sighs> Explosive replicator, huh? It's got hacking. Man, is Ion Blast Heavy Laser the build? Even with Explosive Replicator, man, I don't know. Explosive Replicator Pegasus? Ugh. Mm -hmm. I need to repair him by fuel. Ion Blast plus Heavy Laser is not enough on its own. Probably get hacking. I'd have to get one more weapon power with this, so that's 120 plus 35, it's 155, I could still buy hacking. Two missiles, I am gonna sell this. Mm, no, I'd probably sell fire beam. Well... Ion Blast Heavy Laser Fire Beam. That is a... That's a six power weapon system. Heavy Laser good for Zoltan Shields. I mean, Ion Blast is even better. I'm gonna do this and this. I'm gonna do this. I need to decide... And we're absolutely getting hacking, but I need to decide what else I'm doing. If you're boarding with Rockman, isn't fire good? Yes, but what you have to think about is how do I get through shields and start a fire? Fire beam doesn't do it on its own. You have to get through shields somehow. Now, if I had these plus the fire beam, sure. But you know how much more scrap that's going to cost me? 125. So I'm nowhere near making that happen. Maybe I could use Ion Blast plus fire beam. But that'd be another 50 in the, into that. So all the things that you all are talking about 
is really expensive. I want to do those things, but just buying hacking is the correct play here. Now, how do I do that while repairing and getting fuel? Artemis on its own is also very good boarding support. Like if I fight a ship that's got three shields and a heal bay, I turn off my heavy laser, turn on my Artemis, and we deal with the heal bay as long as it hits. So we're buying hacking every time. Yeah, I kind of think I just sell the fire beam. God, it would be so good on the boss, I think. Try instead if I buy missiles, too. What if I sell nothing and keep this so I have options? We're still primarily a boarding ship. Well, like, what am I buying if I sell Artemis or Firebeam right now? Maybe level 2 hack if I sold both. I think I'm going to hold off for now. How many more gems do I have? Six, five, four, three, two, one. I'm in a better place than I was a minute ago. I mean, I have more health. Advanced scanners. All right. Pre-02 upgrade. It's something. Store with no scrap and no fuel or low fuel. No, thanks. I don't know about much better. I'm slightly better off. Please don't be an auto scout. Okay. Like right here. If I ion blast him, his shield's down to shoot his heal bay, then he's in. I think I, think I actually just want to. Mm. Actually, what do I want to do here? I think I want to hack his weapons and missile his heal bay, I think is what I want to do. God, these guys are taking forever to kill. I need this to hit. And he fucking dodged it. And he breach missiled my shields. What was that about us being in a great shape? Followed by an asteroid that immediately breached my piloting. Wow, game. Wow. Wow. That is uneffing believable. Oh my god. Now the asteroid's causing effing double fires. Am I dead? Um. Um. Yes, we are dead. Ah, <sighs> wow. Breach missile into shields, followed by instant asteroid breach into my piloting into death. Yeah, look how much better shape we're in. Aren't we in such better shape? Man. What did we get to? We got three wins in a row. You think Ion would have helped there? Come on, Bilbo. Give me a break. They're in an asteroid field. If I ioned him and... If I boarded... Okay, here's the thing. If I ioned him, I couldn't board. Because you know what happens if I ion his shields and I board? My guys are on a ship that's getting asteroid hit, okay? So, I don't know. I don't know, man. Three died on rock A to asteroid field. Reach missile to shield. 
If your iron is down to one, you time your shots with the asteroids. All right, fine. That was the play. I, I, I don't know. I don't know, man. Second guessing like that, saying I should have just ioned. I don't know. I don't know. That seems a little disingenuous, honestly. Oh, all right, I'm frustrated. I'm frustrated. I'm taking a break. I'm standing stretch. Use restroom. Thanks for hanging out. Hope y'all are having a good time. I'm getting wrecked in FTL like normal. I can't get past three in a row. I'm getting salty and yelling at chat. So I'm going to be back in a bit while I clear my head. Thanks for hanging out. See you in just a bit, my friends. Did I have enough scrap for third shield? No, I had one scrap. I spent it all at the store to get Ion Blast Heavy Laser. Oh, man. And there are people that say you can predict the breach missile shields and asteroid field in 23 jumps. What? Maybe boarding was greedy. Maybe it was. I mean... He had two shields. I had an Ion Blast Mark II if I'd used Heavy Laser. I mean, I had two missiles at the start of this fight, right? Two or three missiles? What do we do? We Ion Blast. Hope he doesn't dodge. Hope that Asteroid Field hits. And then hope our Heavy Laser doesn't get dodged. I mean, that's a lot of shots that have to not get dodged. Um, I boarded him thinking if I took down his weapons, maybe I don't die to a missile, but I mean, it was a breach missile to the shields. I think I even microed correctly to get my engines maxed. My mech, well, my, my, my engines powered. Oh, man. I don't, I don't know what the play was there. Maybe the play was selling Artemis and Firebeam at the store and repairing more. That might have kept me alive a bit longer. Maybe that was the play. I thought keeping my options open was better. I don't know. It's freaking Rock A, and I the, and I never found weapons. So, like, honestly, what are you going to do when you're Rock A and you can't find weapons? You die. That's what happens.
You frickin' die. Alright, let me update my title. We're at a frickin' streak of zero again, man. I just cannot get three in, past three in a row. It's a tough choice here for keeping options, too. Like, I mean... Maybe the play was not get hacking. Maybe that would have I would have had 80 scrap more. I could have What could I have done with 80 more scrap? Healed for more, get more dodge. I mean, buying hacking is always the right choice, right? Well, in that case I don't know if not buying hacking would have helped. Maybe I should have hacked piloting and missled his weapons. Maybe that was the play. I hacked weapons to hack the missile. Maybe the play was actually hacking his piloting, missiling his weapons. What was his other weapon besides the missile? Was it a two or one power weapon? I don't know. Ah, oh, I don't know. I don't know. I think maybe the play was hack his, well, maybe hack his engines and missile his weapons and hope his missile goes offline. It was a two power weapon, so if that were the case, he would have shot his two power weapon once, then got his missile back online, I think. And if he had done that, that might have bought us more time. I don't know. I don't know. All right, well, I keep hoping that I'm getting better, and then I die to situations like that, and I'm like, am I getting any better? <laughs> like, I just, I don't know if I'm getting any better. Uh, I just don't know. Alright, time to start a new streak from scratch, because I can't make any progress at all in this stinking challenge. Here we go. Random ship in 3, 2, 1, random. Kestrel A, let's go. Let's go, Kestrel A. Ship that actually starts with not trash tier weapons for once. Although instant solar flare with missile could wreck us. If he hits my shields, we're screwed. Okay, good. Uh, gosh, I want to save my missiles, but solar flare into shields would be bad. Okay. It's okay, we can deal with that. Makes you feel any better? You believe I'm still one of the best players in the world for this game? Well, thank you. I don't know if that's true. <laughs> I guess you have to qualify that with top number. I appreciate that. Uh, let's see here. All these things connect. Am I looking for a store early on this ship? I kind of just want to get second shield early. It does make me feel a little better that you think that. I don't know how true it is, but I appreciate the sentiment. I want to get this drone offline. Oh god. Oh god, don't hit my sh Oh, good frickin' dodges right there. Wow, he dodged 50% of my shots. No, he dodged 75%. Well, um, this is bad. I hate this game, man. I hate this goddamn game. What the hell am I supposed to do against shit like this? The hell am I supposed to do, man? No, I'm not restarting. If I restart, I'm rerolling another ship. You know what? I'll get frickin' Slug B or some crap. Double reward, not worth that 12 damage we took or whatever BS that was. Ugh. This ship needs defense early. Its weapons are competent against two shields. Where the RNG on scouts is boosted. Early combat drones are brutal. I mean, sure. 
Yeah, I don't need to store any shields. That's what I need. Okay, man. Gonna get, I'm just gonna get my ass kicked all day today, it looks like. Gonna board me. See if I got a fire from that spot. Uh, looks like we did. Double NG repair party, though. Goodness. A shield value point is giving me help right now. I'm using a lot of missiles right now. These ships are really feeling stronger than they should for Sector 1. Do I sing Phil Collins? No. I don't think I've ever sung one of his... What, you mean for karaoke or something? I mean, I don't think so. I know, I know some of his songs. Chip was crew killable. Did you see the he's running away message, Sleeping Dragon? I'm not taking a chance with that. He was running away with two NGs repairing. Crew kill is not something... I think you are... Extremely optimistic if you're going for a crew kill against double NGs running away. I only have six jumps here. Ah, defense two drone. Okay, his weapons are crap, but this is a two-shield ship, effectively, Sector 2. Sector 1, I mean. Please don't run. What's up, I'm Queasy. How am I doing? Not great. I just had my streak ended by BS, so... Not too great. I know my happiness should not depend on my success in a children's video game, but for whatever reason, it does. Okay, we get that offline. Well, that's down. I'm going to do this. So, of course, he dodges because, you know, with a shield, a defense 2 drone in Sector 1, he should also have 5,000% dodge. He just should. Defense 2 drone, which I had gotten offline, blocked my missile with his fucking face. Thanks, FTL. Thanks. Hilarious. Really good joke. I can't use any more missiles. I'm down to three missiles on this ship. I should have just been patient and not used missiles, I guess. I was sure he's gonna run. That's really good, actually. almost use that. I need power first, though, so let's do this first. Defense 2 jo doing its job. I don't think its job is to block missiles with its face, but, you know, I guess so. The game is so childish. Why are you playing it, Kappa? I know. I know. It's a good question. The real question is, why are you watching me play this game? <laughs> That's the real question. Why are you watching me playing this children's game? Because I yell at it, probably. This game is too salty for children, that's for sure. I want to get some engine and piloting training. Yeah, I don't know. I'm not in the mood for training right now. It has to be the right ship. And that was not a ship that I was in the mood for. I'm an entertaining streamer. Thank you, Dark Shadow. You're, you're just you're here to make you're here to make me feel better today, and I appreciate that about you. I appreciate that. Can I have a double reward? We get a quest marker that I can do. Okay, okay. 
Is that a Hidden Federation base that I need sensors for? You watch for the journey. That's, that's very philosophical of you. That defense drone's name was Scott Sterling. It's probably a reference to something. I don't know if I get it, but if I got it, I'd probably laugh. Watch the stream to learn better English. There you go. Hmm. Alright, I'm going to do something I don't do very often. I'm going to get level 2 sensors on purpose and not from a cheap thing, a cheap event. Because I think that maybe this is the Mantis, the thing that needs level 2 sensors. Scott Sterling is the goalie that blocks with his face. Ah, okay, that is pretty funny. Alright, well, I wasted my scrap there. It's fine. It's fine. Alright, I want a weapon upgrade so I can use Pike Beam. That's first laser. If there's a store there, where do I want to go there? Yes, I would. So I'm going to go one, two. No, I'm not. I'm going one, two. I can't get three. Oh, I almost just dove sector one. Wait, no, I can get three. One, two, three. Okay, yes. And a volleyball player? Scott Sterling is also a volleyball player that plays with his face. Do I shave my top or does nothing grow there? Um, if I didn't shave up here, it would be very thin um, hair. There would be hair, but it's very, very few and far between. You can see if I get closer. No, you probably can't see. There are, there are tiny hairs all over, but it's very thin. It would look not very good. Okay, is he running? He is not running. Scott Sterling, it's a skit. Oh, oh, it was like a Saturday Night Live type thing or a YouTube skit channel or something. You mean this skit? Have I seen this skit? Oh, I have seen that. That is pretty funny. Yeah, I have seen that. It's pretty funny. I'll watch that later. Uh, double reward? Hey, okay. I'll take a double reward. Uh, I'm going to go to the exit and then the next sector before I spend the scrap to get pipe beam online. You would like to be the pilot. Sure. You actually beat Inan. I don't think Inan asked for that yet. So you got it. Shin. Obi one. Yeah, you got beat. And then you got beat for once. Tour double rewards this sector. Yeah, except for that one fight where we took a crap ton of damage. That was a really good sector. Wow, now that's an interesting choice. Civilian and abandoned. Which gives you more scrap? I know civilians like generally considered the best one, but maybe abandoned would be better? Would abandoned be better? I do have stuff I want to sell, so it's probably still just civilian, right? I think it's just civilian still. Um, yeah, sorry about that timeout. If you're, if you're trying to do links, you have to be a mod or a, a be subbed to be able to do that without getting without getting timed out unless you get permission for, for links. Sad, lanious noises. Okay. <laughs> Uh, okay. Alright, vent that other human. That other filthy human. I think he'll now try to come in here, right? There we go. Okay, we didn't take any damage from stupid, filthy humans. Human on human violence. It's a real problem these days. A lot of red on that map. There is a lot of red on that sector map. You think that video was somebody ripping the video, trying to post the original? Oh, okay. Weird lag thing there. Do that so I now have the option for first laser pike beam if we want.
Okay, you can damage us only if your hacking hits something bad. Okay, actually you can't damage us, we're fine. So... Oops. If he starts running, I'll power up my Ike Beam, but I think we're okay here. Could you stop hacking my piloting, though? I would appreciate that if you'd stop it. Have I gotten any dodges at all yet? Four. Okay. Pop, pop, pop. Wow, okay, we are getting a lot of double rewards, actually. What do I have in the way of distress beacon blue options? Do I have anything? I did get level 2 sensors. I have a missile. I have a carefully cut the ship out. I think I have a couple. I can't do giant alien spiders. So I'll be able to see every jump except that one if I go the distress. Oh, gosh. Distress beacon. Yeah, I guess I'll go to distress. What's the highest shield power you have gotten by Sector 3 without modded ships? I, I've probably had three shields by Sector 3 on some crazy OP run. Uh, I don't actually have a blue option here, do I? No. There's a chance you don't take five free hole damage there. But not when you're me. And FTL is FTL. But I honestly couldn't tell you, Dark Savant Shadow. It's, it's hard to remember specific stats like that when I have whatever ungodly amount of hours I have in FTL. Five freehold damage is a blue option every ship has. Uh, this is true except for the whole blue part, because there were no blue options there. If you haven't followed too much lately, what became the play one run a day to avoid salt? What became the play one run a day to avoid salt. Oh, um, that I talked about during during Christmas time. I actually am kind of doing that. On Thursdays and Fridays, I am playing one run a day, and then swapping games. So I am doing that, attempting it. Um, I am not. I, I didn't. When I said about playing one run a day. I think I might have said something about I might try doing that every day, but I don't. I don't want to swip, swatch, swip, blah, blah, blah. I don't want to switch games that often. So currently, the schedule, which is not updated in my schedule, which I should update in my schedule, is I'm still doing viewerships all day Monday. I'm playing hard mode, no, do oh, no pause, all day Wednesday. And Thursday and Friday, I'm doing one hard no pause run and then swapping to another game. So that's that's kind of I've been I kind of did a compromise of that idea, I guess. Actually, I'm gonna go here. I'm gonna see if either of those are stores that they're not. I'm gonna go here because I think I see more over this way. I will repair ten damage for twenty. That's well. I think store repairs are still two right now, so... Yeah, still do that. It's the same as going to a store for repairs. I do still have stuff to sell, right? Man, I have two drones to sell now, actually. How far did I get in balloons? Um... Had I finished all the easy maps? I don't know. I got... I kind of... That was my game, that was my desalinate game. Then the game to desalinate became... Rotato. And then I recently started Grounded. So I've just been kind of swapping between games lately. Okay, that would be a dead end. That could be a store I could use. Um... I think, okay, well, at least these ships are ships that can't damage me. I think. I don't know. 
Balloons is one of those games where I don't know how to measure progress. I popped a lot of balloons. So that's how far I got. <laughs> you can look at my hours on Steam if you want. That will probably answer your question better than anything I can think of. I honestly don't know. Don't know how you judge progress in that game. I killed one or two bosses. Even did one on the highest difficulty level. Or there's only two, so. You'll be able to more watch as you broke a bon bone skiing and you're now stuck at home. Ouch. I'm sorry to hear that. Glad you'll be here. Sorry you had to break a bone, though. That sounds painful. My Mac, my by map category and bosses. Um, I killed two bosses. One on a higher difficulty. I think I was close to finishing all the easy maps. Actually, I think I was getting into the normal maps when I started getting into. Uh, when I swapped over to playing Brotato. Okay, there's some weapons. Cloaking mind control. Um, 16 second charge time. 12 second charge time. <sighs> Do I even buy a weapon here? Maybe I just buy mind control, actually. Do I want a weapon? Doing all modes on all maps is really grindy. Changing up a bit is definitely good. Yeah, it was getting pretty grindy. I was still enjoying it, but I just, I, there were other games I wanted to play. Rotato was getting grindy, then I swapped to Grounded. That's kind of how I go in games. I play them until I'm like, okay, I am ready to try out something else. I'm going to do this. I'm going to get one of my three systems. I think my weapons are still fine, especially since I got a free pike beam. If I get one power, I can actually even use it um, with my burst laser, too. Probably sell the beam to get online. No, I wasn't. If I was going to sell anything, it was Artemis. But I didn't really want to sell any weapons there. Oh, it's got free hacking. Just be my friend for a bit here. Free hacking on my engine is my favorite. Okay, good. Good, good dodge. Oh, and he's actually going to be nice and just sitting there like a stupid person. Okay, good. Okay, good fight. Three fuel and ten scrap. Really? That's my reward? Three fuel and ten scrap? That was a really low reward. Did it give me a map or something that I didn't see because I don't read? Uh, I don't think he gave me a map. Do I even want another store right now? Not really. I want a power is what I want so I can do this. Distress beacon, I have carefully cut that ship out, is about the only distress beacon I think I have. Edge and hack event gives a random scrap payout amount, so there must have been a low payout. Cool, thanks, FTL. Thanks. What's your specialty? O2 for 16. That would have saved me 9 scrap. Okay, I'm not too sad about missing out on that one. I keep hitting B like I have backup battery, which, spoiler alert, I do not have backup battery. 
Okay. Uh, he is running. If I got a fire, I could potentially crew kill. Now that's that's a better deal than what I just got for three fuel, ten scrap. But I really want more scrap than that, so. Three fuel, that's not bad, actually. You know what, I'm going to take that. I'm going to take that deal. Sector 2, I'm probably not going to get much more than that. Using mind control like a piloting hack is so nice. Um, can be. It's not quite that, though, because if they have level 2 piloting, it's not actually a... It's not the same. It's not quite as good. Gosh, this time I'm a lot less si excited about Mantis Control or Mantis Homeworlds. You know what, I'm really sad that we lost that run that we got Kazak on. I, I thought we were in such good shape on that Rock A when we had Kazak with boarding. I'm, I hate losing any run, but oh, that's frustrating. All right, well, with Mantis boarding, I need to OMD obsessively man those doors. I have mind control to help with that, though. Okay, thankfully that connects. So, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. So if I want the quest, I'm going to go here. I'm going to go here. If I get something to sell, I'll go back to the store. If I don't, I'm going to skip the store because I just don't have enough scrap for that store to be worthwhile. Yeah, had Virus and Kazak. Yeah, well, that's a big fat ball of nothing, so I'm not going there. So, 9, 8, 7. I need to be here in 7. 6, 5, we have lots of options. Hard to argue with six missiles when you're still using the Artemis. Still using the Artemis? I'm not actually using it, but... But I know what you mean. I haven't sold it. Fire hits us. Can I please have a free mantis? No, I can have five free hole damage. Hey, go F. Go have a very nice day, FTL. Go have a very nice day. God damn it. It did shield damage. Why the hell did it do shield damage to me? Why the hell did it do shield damage to me, too? Fuck you, FTL. God, that's stupid. Fuck. Was that a defense drone that shot down one shot and then also blocked one with his face? Yes, it is. Give me a break. I have no goddamn shields and it's fucking breached right now. Oh, I think I'm dead again, man. Oh, this is so frustrating. Oh, that can't do anything. I think I'm dead. Uh, I can't see him to mind control. I have no O2. Okay, we dodge a shot. Please, 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 please. God damn this game. <laughs> he dodged two out of three of my fucking shots with a defense two drone. I hate this stupid game. My crew died in the middle of the jump. Thanks, FTL. Why don't you go ahead and go fuck yourself? God, I'm frustrated right now. This shitty game, man. Crew kill if I can stabilize. How the hell did I stabilize in that situation, Dekastera? I would love to know. I would love to know how you think I could have stabilized that situation. Because I don't have an effing clue. I have to go back and forth. This is not going to work, is it? I think I have to have level 2 deal bay to have a chance here. Dead. 
Oh, just barely made it in time. Okay. You said that before you saw the seal damage. Oh, okay. I hate FTL, man. It's just, it's just, just pulling no punches today. We go from free boarding event and a solar flare into free boarding event. No, not free boarding event. Free damage that did shield damage with a defense two drone and two shields. Ion Blast Mark two heavy laser. Like this game is just, it's giving me no fucking chances to do anything. Ah, oh, this is so frustrating, man. It's like no matter what ship I random, I just cannot feel like I can catch a fucking break. It's just frustrating the hell out of me, man. Goddamn FTL things. So I can get the quest and not have to dive. Kazak with a missile. Cool. Please don't hit my weapons or shields. Cool. Alright, we dodge that at least. Crew killing Kazak does nothing for us here. Except maybe a slightly better reward, but no, I don't even think that does. Yep, Kazak had no boarding, strangely enough. This is gonna be a day where I like lose three runs in a row, isn't it? I don't think I've had a day of all losses. I can't remember the last time if I've even had a day like that where I've won zero runs on hard no pause. It's kind of feeling like I'm getting close to that being today's day, the, the, the FTL runs today. Might be a day of zero wins, which would be so disheartening. Solar flare? Sure, why not a solar flare with a goddamn missile? And boarding, cool. Uh, you know what? I actually have to do this because I I can't I can't deal with that actually. Um, hmm. You're gonna have to vent this guy, aren't I? The solar flare could just finish the. Okay, thank God. I was gonna say it could finish our run right there, but it didn't do damage, didn't hit our shields. Okay. I don't think I can repair this. And. In time to leave? Maybe. Be close. Two, three, four. Last year, September, Lane ASA, Slug B, to say three runs, three losses. Wow, did you just look that up? Okay. Okay. Okay, so it won't be the. Okay, how did you. How did you find that? I'm. Not even mad. I'm just impressed that you... I, I'm confused about how you know that. How much damage can a solo flare do instantly? One, and then start a double fire in a system that has one system power and do two. So I think... I only think a solo flare can do one damage to you. I don't think it can do two. But if it sets fire to something, it can do two or three quickly if it's two system runs. Remember because it was a few days after your birthday. Well, you remember my runs way better than I do, Inan. That's impressive. Wow, okay. A whole repair in a store. That's like the only thing from this quest that could maybe keep me back, keep me in this game. Alright, what am I doing? What gets me back in this? 
Long range scanners and repair. I could buy a crew. You're actually trolling. You don't actually remember. Great. Thanks for that troll. Super useful. Um, you believe. Okay. All right. Sure. You can be Ekman. Thanks for the bits, Flirtin. Okay. Uh, what is more important, a crew or repairs? Go buy a crew. What are the crew? One guy with engine training. <sighs> Get long range scanners, so maybe I'll know when I'm jumping into my death. Okay, this guy can't damage us. Wish I had fought one or two more of these guys in this sector. I might attempt to crew kill this. Okay, they're not fighting each other. Now they will, okay. I did that fast enough. Okay, good. Okay, I don't want you to repair that. You should go back over there and fight that guy. No, you're not fighting. Why aren't you fighting? Oh, well. Oh, man. It was one of those runs where I'm just like, uh, just like giving up. I maybe should have restarted at that first rough sector, thing in sector one, but. I don't know, man. I don't know. With all the BS I've been given, FTL, don't you feel like it's time to give me some help? Alright, I'll sell all of my missiles. Now I need to sell my Artemis. Civilian sector? Okay. I need like three free stuff jumps in a row to have a chance to come back. Including free crew. Oh, this could be a terrifying ship that kills me. Pretty strong. Wow, he even gets his shots off before me because I have nobody manning weapons. Oh, <laughs> I hit nothing. I mean, he dodged two out of three of my shots. Okay, I think I can't do anything to this guy. My O2's dead. My O2 is burning. Oh, no, it's not. Uh, yeah, I think I'm dead. Okay. Um. Okay. Oh, he even gets two shots in a row. Uh, he, there's no way he ever fixes that in time. So the only way I win is if I get to the store, get to a store with crew. Get to a store, buy crew. Uh, no, I think I'm dead. I think I get here and my guy dies in the transition. Uh, you have Clombe. If they had Clombe here, man. Um... Do you guys repair this in time to stay alive? I don't think so. <laughs> no. Uh, I 
I sell this to get another crew to try to stay alive. Okay. <laughs> We're not dead yet. Oh, Jesus. Oh, my God. It's just the suffering will never end. So uh, the only way to win is, or the only way to recover is if I get level 2 heal bay. Which I, the only way to do that, if I sell that, I can actually stabilize here. Not stabilizing, we're still about three sectors behind worth in scrap. But I am actually not dead. There you go, everybody. There's my skill in recovering from a situation that... I mean, I don't know if it's actually a situation that I'm going to recover from, but I'm not dead. I'm just prolonging my suffering. You look away for five minutes. Why do people say that all the time? Just, I don't know how to answer the question like, what happened? I look away for five minutes. I don't know how to answer that question. FTL happened. BS keeps happening over and over. Stupid crap, man. Stupid crap. I just had to buy two crew because the guy I did have couldn't fix O2 in time because of bullshit. Bullshit happened. I'm stupidly pretending like this run has a chance, so I'm still playing it. And now I don't have enough weapons to get through shields. I'd love to buy that heavy laser. This store would have been great. Just wonderful. If I wasn't already effing dead all the time. You have weapon training. You have piloting. Comes the comeback of the century. Yeah, sure. God, you want to be the pilot? Sure. On this highway to hell that we're on, you can be the pilot. If I come back and get this heavy laser, there might actually be a shot here. This guy's got five weapon power. Meanwhile, me with my one burst laser too. And his three, ha, his two shields with a shield value point. Honestly, not terrible dodges there. Doesn't matter what I aim at when uh, he dodges one third of our shots. Hey, look at all these uh, weapon value points I have, though. Oh, we hit my sensor, so I can't even use mind control now. All right. Well, it's uh, been less than two hours, and I've already died twice in FTL. So I'm going to take another break, and I'm going to have a cookie to feel better about life. Because FTL hates me and I hate it right back. So uh, thank you all for watching. Hope you're enjoying my death, pain, and dismemberment. When we come back, we'll see if we can random a ship and actually get past Sector 3 for once in our lives. Because I... I don't... I can't seem to make any good decisions. I'll be back in just a bit, my friends. Y'all rock, I suck.